Hello, I bought this painting today, someone called Vic. See it says Midland Railway. And on the bottom it says London, Manchester, Liverpool Express through the peak of Derbyshire. Now that is actually a Midland compound pulling one, two, three, four, five, six, seven carriages. That is actually the Monsell Viaduct. That's the River Y going through there. This is a model of the uh, Midland compound 1000. A little man there. Good detail inside. This is not a review of this model, but just to. I know that in the painting there, the effects pre. I can't say that word. Prosthetic. Anyway, um, you can tell that it's too big. I mean, why they painted that locomotive too big? That should be a lot smaller, but then made it a lot larger than it should be. Tell you a bit about the uh, Midland compound. Midland Railway 1000 class was a passenger steam locomotive designed by Samuel White Johnson, Chief Mechanical Engineer of the Midland Railway. They were developed from a batch of five locomotives introduced in 1902 with a variety of interesting features. Three cylinder compound design with one high pressure inside cylinder and two low pressure outside cylinders. Smith started arrangement and for the first two locomotives, independent control of high pressure and low pressure valve gears. Johnson, successor Richard Dealey built a large and simpler right version of these locomotives, fitting his own starting arrangement and making the engine simpler to drive. Here's a quick, more of a close up of the painting. Let's see, maybe the, the, I said that's the river there, the viaduct. Or the, hills in the background and the Monsell Head Hotel is just up there out the pitch you can't see it in this painting but that's where I work and then I don't even see it but there is actually a, a, some about there there is a footbridge which is made out of stone. I can actually read that but it's quite hard to miss but it does actually say Midland Corridor Express through Monsell Dale peak of Derbyshire. Right on the painting in the bottom left hand corner. That's now I've just there. turned it over because on the back it does say X Bear Lane Station Hersham. That's apparently that's where this used to hang at Bear Lane Station. So if you want to Google that you can but here's a tiny bit about the station now. Right here's a bit about Bear Lane Station. Bear Lane is a railway station on the Morecambe branch line which runs between Lancaster and Hersham Port. The station is situated two and a half miles west of Lancaster. Serves the suburbs of Bear in Morecambe, Lancashire. It is owned by Network Rail and managed by Northern Trains. The station was opened as Pollerton Lee Sands on 8th August 1864 by the London and North Western Railway being renamed Bear Lane on the 1st of August 1864. A level crossing with a highway known as Bear Lane exists immediately to the west of the station which until recently was controlled by the adjacent Bear Lane signal box. A thin cabin to the Preston PSB area. This box was closed on the 8th of December 2012 with the signal equipment was renewed by network rail and control of the crossing switched to CCTV and transferred to the present power box. The old station on the platform is now a private dwelling. This was auctioned to the public and featured on the BBC programme Home Under the Hammer, a show about buildings which are auctioned to the public and redeveloped. Here are some photos of it. As you can see there, there's an old black and white photo back in the day. Well, 
also on the back in the middle it says designed and framed by the Photochrom Co Limited London I think they still exist today I couldn't find much information about them, apart from they've got 100,000 images a day they do or something like that but anyway that's my little video about this painting my model railway is now most definitely is the Midland Railway or Midland Montreal Model Railway the triple MR for short thanks for watching I'll see you in my next video thank you bye